I signed up for a Johnson & Johnson vaccination this morning. Um, and now that I'm hearing that there's going to be a pause on that, I'm wondering if I'm going to get a vaccination like scheduling, rescheduling or cancellation notice from CVS or from DC Health or exactly who am I going to get that from? Chris Walker says most of his family and friends have been vaccinated. So now that he's eligible, he wanted to get vaccinated as quickly as possible. That's why this morning he signed up through CVS to get the Johnson & Johnson vaccine later this week. A decision he says he made even though the FDA put a pause on it due to concerns of blood clots. As of right now, you're still scheduled technically to get a Johnson & Johnson vaccine on Friday. Yeah, sounds like it. Now he's trying to figure out what is going to happen with his appointment and when he can get vaccinated. <laughs> At this point, I'm I'm open to, you know, whatever is available. It's just, the, I mean, the big thing is I feel in kind of like a limbo right now where it's like I don't want to schedule another vaccine until I get this one worked out. According to CVS, they implemented the FDA's suggested pause in the use of the Johnson & Johnson vaccine. So why was Walker able to sign up for an appointment and when will he be able to reschedule? I reached out to CVS to find out. They said Walker should look out for an email. My ultimate goal is honestly to get vaccinated as, as soon as possible. I was texting with Walker just before the show and he said he got a notification from CVS that his appointment was canceled and he even got a link from them saying that he could reschedule and after about 30 minutes of reloading that homepage, Larry, he says he finally got an appointment for tomorrow. He's getting the Moderna vaccine.